10 films to watch on TV this Christmas. Indeed, it's the most wonderful time of the year, for the television schedule is littered with films to watch. A free view premiere for this charming Disney animation from 2016, which sees a rural rabbit, Judy Hopps, Jennifer Goodwin, relocate to the big city to achieve her dreams of being a cop. Alongside the fast-talking, sarcastic Fox, Nick Wilde, Jason Bateman, they uncover a criminal conspiracy which has serious consequences for the well-being of the animal kingdom. The dazzling animation and superb screenplay, which is both funny and politically irrelevant, means there is something for children and adults alike. A classic coming-of-age story from Rob Reiner, in which four 12-year-old boys, Will Wheaton, River Phoenix, Corey Feldman and Jerry O'Connell, go on the hunt for the body of a missing person. Based on Stephen King's short story, this remains the best adaptation of the author's work, with the four excellent central performances accompanying some astute direction and heartfelt storytelling. All four films in the series are being shown over the festive period, but it's the third installment that remains the highlight. This entry sees our hero, Harrison Ford, seeking the Holy Grail, globetrotting with his father, Sean Connery, in a race to get there before the Nazis. One of the best blockbusters of all time, Steven Spielberg's fantastic action-adventure features dynamite chemistry between Ford and Connery, a quip-laden script, and a memorable opening sequence featuring River Phoenix as a young Indiana. Often regarded as the best film of all time, Hitchcock's brilliant thriller remains one of the most appreciated and influential works of all time. The classic mystery stars James Stewart as John Scotty Ferguson a detective who was forced out of the army due to his acute fear of heights. Tasked with finding an old acquaintance's wife, Kim Novak, Scotty's investigation involves obsession, murder, madness, and of course a date with his very own fear. Featuring of an impeccable score, revolutionary camera work and quintessential Hitchcockian twists, this film is timeless. A warm and heartfelt story of parental loss and grief in which journalist Martin Sixsmith, Steve Coogan, helps Philomena Lee, Judy Dench, find her long-lost son. Her boy was taken from her whilst she worked at a convent as teenager, and the incident has haunted her since. Stephen Freer's deft direction and Coogan's sublime script bring a light-hearted touch to an otherwise heartbreaking story, but it's the chemistry of the two stars that really make the film soar. How Miyazaki's animated fantasy remains Studio Ghibli's most successful and acclaimed piece of work, with its timeless message and stunning visuals contributing to its glowing reputation amongst audiences and critics alike. Ten-year-old Chihiro and her family move to a new village, before a wrong turn transports them to a world of ghosts, magical creatures and dangerous spirits. Resembling something of an anime inflected Alice in Wonderland. This strange and often surreal film still retains an enormous sense of accessibility, a trademark of the studio's work. The second Spielberg entry in the list, this enchanting sci-fi remains one of the most beloved family films of all time. Ten-year-old Elliot, Henry Thomas, and his younger sister, Drew Barrymore, seek to protect an alien who is stranded alone on Earth, attempting to hide the creature from both their mother and the encroaching authorities. 36 years on from its original release, the film has lost none of its charm, with the central relationship between Elliot and E.T. being one of the most touching ever put on screen. Perhaps the least well-known feature on this list, John Michael McDonagh's black comedy is a virtuoso display of screenwriting, expertly weaving tragedy with belly laughs. Brendan Gleeson plays Father James, a priest in a small Irish town whose life is threatened during a confessional. He is given a week to sort out his affairs and whatnot, offering guidance to the locals whilst he tries to identify his potential killer. Gleason and the supporting cast are superb, but it's McDonagh's unique script that makes this one of the best British films of recent years. There's nothing family-friendly or festive about this riotous, boisterous biopic from Martin Scorsese. The titular character is Jordan Belfort, Leonardo DiCaprio a stockbroker who seemingly has no moral compass as he commits several acts of debauchery, with his firm's office space resembling something of a circus. Though the film is far from perfect, a trimming down of the runtime is sorely needed, 
Scorsese's energetic direction, DiCaprio's electrifying performance, and Terence Winter's snappy screenplay make this an incredibly entertaining watch. Alan Bennett's traggy comic tale of eight Oxbridge hopefuls is both cheeky and loving, successfully transitioning from the stage to the screen. The pupils are taught by two contrasting figures, Hector, Richard Griffiths, suggests they embrace knowledge, while Snooby Irwin, Stephen Campbell Moore, tells them to improvise and act on emotion, providing the boys with a far more well-rounded experience. Bennett's script is sharp, with the cast members, who include Dominic Cooper, James Corden and Russell Tovey, bringing the charismatic characters to life.